now you can arm yourself with the knowledge and training it takes to be great. Pride Sports and Step are proud to introduce the Pride Phenom Training Academy. This program features a nutrition plan, before and after evaluation, and a comprehensive instructional workbook. Former NFL quarterback Achilles Smith and Super Bowl winning wide receiver Oz Hakeem are our guest instructors. For more information on how you can sign up today, visit us at www.prideusports.org. Get combine ready. Get all-star ready. Get spring football ready today at the Pride Phenom Training Academy. And welcome to sunny San Diego. And here's the opening kickoff. Kicked off to number nine, who gets the ball and runs up the field and is tackled, tackled just near the 50-yard line. And we have the second annual Pride All-Star Classic underway. I'm expecting this game to be one of the best games out there. We have some of the best talent in San Diego uh, playing against some of the best talent in Arizona. And I'll tell you what, these teams from Arizona came down here, and I don't think they came down here uh, uh, to lose. Um, the head coach of the Arizona uh, sixth grade team is a uh, nationally recognized head coach uh, uh, that's put together a real good team out here. And they come out in a five-man front. San Diego lines up, and he gives the ball off to the up back, and, but he keeps it. This is David Justice, who sacked for a five-yard loss, bringing up a second down and 16. Justice rolls out, has a guy in the flat, but it's almost intercepted by number three by a host of Arizona All-Stars. I'll tell you what, these Arizona All-Stars came to play. These Arizona All-Stars came to play, bringing up a fourth down and long for the sixth grade San Diego All-Stars. Fourth down and long for the San Diego All-Stars. Situation. So the Arizona All-Stars, oh, I'm sorry, the San Diego All-Stars set to, uh, actually they're not going to punt, brings up a fourth and long situation, but a motion call, they're flagged for motion here because the quarterback didn't wait. So that's going to be a legal motion bringing up a, a fourth down. A fourth down and very long. Let's see what Coach McCall dials up here for this uh, sixth grade San Diego team. Throws a long pass, and it is picked off by number seven of the Arizona All-Stars, who's running down the sideline, who has a host of Arizona All-Stars in front of him. Gets to the end zone, and he's tackled at the three-yard line, bringing up a first and goal for the Arizona All-Stars. Yeah, man, I'm sorry. 
so I, I actually don't think I'm able to come through for you. Man, I appreciate you. I thought you wanted me to do a short announcement, but yeah. No, no, it's okay. That's okay. I appreciate it. So after the interception, my number seven, Jalen Carter, he's going to be the quarterback for the Arizona All-Stars and a great return brings up a fourth and goal, I'm a first and goal, I'm sorry, Arizona All-Stars. Inside handoff to number 17, he stopped. After a gain of about an inch, bringing up a second and goal. And here we see number 17 with the halfback dive up the middle. San Diego All-Stars did a good job of stuffing that play. Here we are, second and goal at the three-yard line. Arizona's ready to go. Arizona lines up in a two-back set, gives off to the up-back. After a gain of about one, making it third and goal, Arizona All-Stars. Now this Arizona All-Star team, uh, a very heralded All-Star team, uh, great kids out there from all over Arizona, mainly uh, concentrated in the, uh, the Tempe and Phoenix area. Very talented kids, all All-Stars. Arizona, Arizona lines up in a two-back set. Great show of discipline by the Arizona All-Stars joining the San Diego All-Stars offsides. And Coach, that's a great point that you make. We were here yesterday for the Combine and saw all these kids out on the field. It's a tremendous amount of talent out here today. Absolutely, and you're right. I'll tell you what, these uh, Arizona All-Stars came out here to compete, uh, and that's what they're doing. And they got them, they find themselves in a third and goal situation uh, with the ball just outside the end zone. Let's see what the San Diego team can do as this young quarterback leads his team and gets them set up in a split formation. And it looks like he gives it to the up back, number 17, who is stopped at the goal line, bringing up a fourth and very short. Great job by the San Diego defense stuffing that play. Looks like Arizona's intent on running the ball, but it, San Diego's having none of it. Brings up a fourth down. Ball just outside the goal line. Arizona fans, make some noise for your team. San Diego fans, make some noise for your team. Coach, I'm real glad to see this in the All-Star game. It's fourth down. They're going for it. It's an All-Star game. Let's do it. And it looks like they might have got in there. We'll wait for the signal. And it looks like it looks like they did not make it. Turnover on downs. Great Turnover stop. On downs. Great San stop. San Diego ball on the one inch yard line. Great stop by the San Diego All-Stars. Excellent job by the San Diego All-Stars to stop those guys there. Coach, that's a great point. That was a great, great effort after the turnover and having the ball inside the five yard line. Arizona could not punch it in. Great stop at the one yard line. San Diego takes over. We'll see what they do. And they're coming out in the wishbone formation. Give it to the fullback, and it looks like he stopped right at the line of scrimmage. Great defensive stop by the Arizona All Stars, bringing up a second down and about eight to go. And here we go, second down and about nine yards from the one yard line. San Diego once again comes out in the wishbone formation. The quarterback keeps it for about a gain of maybe a half a yard line. He looks like he got stopped at the line of scrimmage. Great discipline by the Arizona defense, staying home and recognizing that the quarterback kept that ball. Makes it third down and about eight yards from the three. San Diego needs to reach the 11 yard line to make a first down. Once again, wishbone formation, San Diego, third and eight. They go with the sweep, but running back's in trouble in the end zone. Great defense by the Arizona All-Stars. Almost causing a safety in the south. Bringing them back to the original line of scrimmage. Fourth down, very long. Bringing up a punting situation. 
situation. Running back did a great job. He was in trouble in the end zone, but did a great job of getting out and preventing the safety. It is now fourth and nine from San Diego's own two-yard line. We'll see if they come out and punt or if they go for it. Like San Diego's coming out in punt formation. Arizona has two players back deep to receive, and it's a great punt out to about the 30 yard line where Arizona will take over first and 10. While we have a break in the action, we want to let you know that this game is br brought to you by Pride Youth Sports. It's a beautiful day out here in, in North County, San Diego. Great day for a game of football. First and 10, Arizona comes out with the sweep. Running back comes, great job by the defense. He might have got one yard on that play. Second and nine. At the 31, I'm sorry, the 29 yard line. Arizona comes out, second down and nine from the 29 yard line. They come out in the spread formation out of the shotgun. Shotgun formation, which he goes in motion. Takes a fly sweep, number 17, quarterback keeper. After a game of about three, brings up a third down and a long five. Arizona's running a shotgun spread zone read option. Number 17, the quarterback kept that one. Four gain of about three yards. Makes it third and six from the 26 yard line. Once again, Arizona comes out in the shotgun spread. Number 31 goes in motion, fakes. Number one goes up top and he is open and he overthrew the receiver by just a little bit. Great play call, they just couldn't connect on that. Just overthrown. Great play call by the Arizona All-Stars. Fourth down nonetheless. And now we have a fourth down and six from the 26-yard line. <laughs> Looks like Arizona's going for it, and why not? They're on the positive side of the field. But the first formation is a spread. Shotgun. Once again, 31 in motion. The fake. The 17 keeps it and looks like he has the first down. Great play by number 17. Number 31 laid out a key block for him, enabled him to pick the first down. Nice run by number 17 for the first down. So now we have first and 10. So that brings up a first and 10 for the Arizona All-Stars and they come out in a, in a spread formation. A complicated offense for these guys, wouldn't you say? But they run it to perfection. And that, I would agree, Coach, they're doing an excellent job. You guys didn't have too much time to practice. Uh, so in order to run this offense, I'm, I'm impressed by what they're doing. Me too. I think this Arizona offense is uh, 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 very talented. Um, a lot of these guys went to the, uh, uh, the, the championship game in, uh, in uh, uh, Orlando, Florida. Uh, so we have a, a very talented team. And, and more than just a talented team, this coaching staff, again, is one of the best coaching staffs in the country. They put together not only an all-star team out there in Arizona, but an all-star coaching staff. 
Great point, Coach. We got to meet a lot of these guys throughout the week. Great guys, very knowledgeable of the game, and they're passionate about making these players better. And San Diego with a great defensive play on second down. Arizona lost about three yards on that play. Brings up third and about 13, 14 from the 23 yard line. So third and a long 13, almost 14 here. Uh, they come back out in that spread offense. You check with the refs in number 31 in motion. Fake the fly sweep. Number, got a guy open underneath, number 17, and he's tackled after a, after a gain of about 10 yards, bringing up a fourth down for the Arizona All-Stars. And Coach, if you'll notice the versatility of number 17, he is the quarterback, but was actually the receiver on that play, came open underneath, and gained about five, six yards on that play. I tell you what, that kid number 17, he's impressed me so far. His name is Zach, and I talked with his mom earlier. That's Zach with two Ks for a double dose of that playmaking ability. Just wanted to make sure I got that shot out. And while we have a, a timeout, we just like to let you know that this game is brought to you by Pride Youth Sports. Uh, Pride Sports uh, is a place where you can go to find all of your youth sports action. That's www.prideyouthsports.com. Oh, you can? Okay. So. Pride. So right now, uh, uh, again, you can find the action at www.prideusports.org. Coming out of the timeout, it's fourth and about six yard line, six yards to go. Arizona once again in the shotgun. Number one drops back. They set up the screen for number 17. He's got some blockers in front of him. It looks like he's going to get in. Touchdown, Arizona. Great play call. Great play call by Arizona. San Diego was not ready. They had a couple of blockers out in front of number 17, and he scooted on into the end zone. Touchdown, Arizona. 6 nothing, Arizona. Arizona All-Stars lining up for the extra point. We have number 24 kicking. A little bit of a high snap, but great job by the holder to get that down. But he just barely missed it. Great play by the holder to get control the high snap and still give the kicker a chance to make that. Unfortunately, he missed it just a little bit to the left. So with that, in the first quarter, we have six nothings, Arizona All-Stars. Starts lined up, ready to kick it off to San Diego. Great kick off, picked up at the 20 by number eight. And eight Cuts shakes and bakes, and shakes and bakes. Cuts across the field. Great 
Great return by number eight. Brought it all the way back out to the 46-yard line. Makes it first and 10, San Diego. We'll see if San Diego's able to, to make something in this possession. Arizona played great defense on, on the last drive. San Diego's preferred formation. Wishbone. Three running backs all lined up even behind the quarterback. There's a pitch. There's some laundry on the field. Number one tries to get outside, but great containment by the Arizona defense. They swarm to the ball. That's a lot of five, five, six yards on that play. We'll see what the penalty is. Looks to be against Arizona. San Diego was, had an illegal formation. Brings up a second and let's say about Did not have enough men on the line of scrimmage. With the loss of six yards, Arizona declined the penalty. Brings up second and 16 from the 40 yard line. And there appears to be a little confusion out there. Number seven didn't know quite what the play was. Timeout. So, so San Diego is supposed to call a timeout. Arizona has a small but vocal crowd today. You know, it's, it's pretty oh, difficult exactly. for a lot of the, the families to make the trip out. Okay. From Arizona. Talk, talk to Christine. I'm, I'm in the box. Christine is the, uh, she's, uh, yeah, she'll take care of you. I'm the director. It is what it is. I don't care if we have commentating or not. While there's a break in the action, once again, we'd like to let you know that this game is brought to you by Pride Sports. Visit www.prideyouthsports.org for all your, your youth sports needs. Coming out of timeout, San Diego is ready. Second and 16 from the 40-yard line. They're coming out in a more traditional set now. One running back, three wide receivers. It's a wide receiver screen. Great job by the Swarm in Arizona defense. They read that play. Wide receiver picked up about three yards on that play. Brings up third and about 12 yards to go. Arizona's been doing a great job on defense. San Diego comes out, single set formation. Two wide receivers split up top. Single receiver at the bottom. Number seven with the drawback, running the fade route. Great interception by number two. What an incredible play by number two. That is one of the better plays you'll see out there. Number two, the safety came over, read the play on the fade route, made a one-handed interception. And I tell you what, this Arizona crowd is hyped up. Great play. Arizona takes over at the 42-yard line. And so far, Arizona's been outplaying the San Diego All-Stars. We have a score of 6-0 in the first quarter. Arizona comes out on offense at the 42-yard line. Shotgun formation. And they are running the zone, zone read option. There's a lot of We'll see what the call is. It appears to be against Arizona, but we'll wait to see what the call is. Arizona 
Number 51 got caught with a hold on that play. It's gonna negate that gain of two by the running back. And it's backing the Arizona All-Stars up all the way back to the 29 yard line. Mason, first and 20 from the first and 29, 29, yard, line. 29 yard line. Once again, Arizona in the shotgun formation. Four wide receivers, single setback. Number 31 goes in motion. He takes the handoff, trying to get to the outside. And a great job on sending the race to retain that play. It's a game of four yards. Brings up second down and 13 from the 37-yard line. Excellent job on San Diego defense reading, reading that sweep out of the shotgun. Excellent containment on the left-hand side, and they were able to stop it for a minimal game. It's the fake to number 31, but the quarterback keeps it. Minimal game. It's a gain of two yards. Now we have third and 12 from the 39-yard line. Arizona needs to get to the San Diego 48-yard line to get a first down. And it's like we have a timeout on the field. Quarter. End of the first quarter. That is the Arizona All-Star 6, and Diego All-Star 0. With your score being Arizona All-Star 6, San Diego All-Star 0. I'm impressed by how good these teams look. Arizona All Star teams that had no practice, maybe two weeks. Okay, San Diego makes noise. Where you at? These teams are looking pretty efficient, like they've been playing together for years. Just wanted to take the time to say thank you to all the Arizona fans and parents that took the trip down here to be a part of this great day. Again, Arizona fans, make some noise. Thank you so much. Typically in all-star games, you tend to see a lot of penalties, false starts, you know, because the teams haven't played together as a unit too much. That first quarter was pretty clean, not too much dirty laundry on the field. As we start the second quarter, they set up the screen for number 17, but they are unable to complete it on third and long. Brings up fourth down from the 39-yard line. Arizona needs to get to the San Diego 48 to convert the first down. We'll see if they go for it, if they line up to punt. Looks like Arizona is going for it. They are coming out once again in the shotgun formation. We see, the, we see the snap. The 31 in motion, but there's some laundry on the field. It looks like there was some motion against Arizona. False start. Arizona's going to back him up. We'll see if that changes their mind, if they're still going to go for it, or if they'll line up to punt. We are looking at fourth and 15. Ball is spotted at the Arizona 34-yard line. They need to reach the San Diego 48 to get a first down. Lined up in a shotgun spread formation, four wide, single setback. Quarterback ready to shoot the snap. And some more laundry in the field. We have another penalty, looks like a delay of game. We have a delay of game against Arizona, which is going to back him up an additional five yards. And they appear to be going the wrong way. They need to be heading in southeast direction. But with the laundry on the field, they have fourth and forever to go.
San Diego appears to think that Arizona will be punting this time as they send number one deep to return. We'll see if that indeed is, is the case. And it looks like they are they will be punting number 24 deep. Arizona in the punt formation. The snap is off. He gets the ball off cleanly, but it's a short, very short punt in San Diego's favor. That ball shot was maybe about 15 yards. Got a San Diego bounce. And I'll tell you what. This is a well-coached Arizona team. One thing that I just noticed about the way they play football, even on the special teams, I noticed that these guys play a different brand of football in terms of, of the, the, uh, the smarts of the game. That is a testament to the coaching staff. I had an opportunity to talk with these guys at length. Uh, most of these Arizona coaches, I mean, they are very, very passionate about this game of football. So uh, it doesn't surprise me that they have a 6 nothing lead here early. But I, I do believe in what these San Diego coaches are doing as well and I, I think that they'll get it together um, coach McCall again one of the best coaches in the city which is why he's doing this game here today James I agree great point coach coach McCall is one of the best coaches we have here in San Diego he's doing a great job so far once again the score is only six nothing it's great competition here on first down San Diego gets about three yards ball is spotted just short of the 35 yard line Brings up second down and eight. Okay, so second down and eight. Let's see what this uh, uh, San Diego offense dials up here. I mean, uh, uh, Notice the practice and they're, they're going to be a run first offense here. And, and, and uh, uh, they're going to trip to uh, do some trickeration here with a, a switch formation here. And it's a direct snap. Okay, it's a direct to the young guy. He makes a move. They are. As you said, they are run first offense. We haven't seen too much passing from them. You know, so it's a matter of time. It looks like they're trying to wear the, San, uh, the Arizona All Stars down with the run. And running back had a little success on that play. Third down. Well, I, I'm definitely a proponent of sticking to the game plan. Um, if your game plan was to come in here to run with a 6 nothing deficit, you, can, you should stick to your game plan. Okay? You shouldn't go away from it because it's not the time to play. I agree, Coach. It's much too early. Much too early. Stick to your game plan. It's only 6 nothing. We have San Diego coming out. Run formation again. The give is to the up back, number 21, with a great run. Gains about 8 yards for the first down. He's taken down at the 24-yard tw line. First and 10, San Diego. They need to get to the 11-yard line. I'm sorry, the 14-yard line to get a first down. And San Diego's starting to get some positive yards on offense. This is the best drive they've had today. First down and 10. Wishbone formation for San Diego once again. Like, Quarterback takes the snap. Number two hands off to number eight with a great run up the middle. Bounces it outside. We'll see if he has enough to get the first down. He is going to be short of the first down by a yard. Nine yard pickup by number eight. Great run up the middle. Great vision. He was one tight tackle away from breaking that. So it looks like the San Diego offense finally is getting it together and they're finding some life here, uh, bringing up a second down and a short two, uh, long one and a half here. And they come out in their base formation, which is that uh, uh, triple headed moss wrap running back and the meatloaf package up front. So number two, 22 gets it. Right, no, great vision. First down, San Diego. What's happening, James? I think that they got their legs underneath them, uh, their sea legs, if you will, you know, out here in San Diego. Uh, uh, and I think they're ready to go. So this brings up a first down in a 10 yard situation inside, so they can still get a first down without getting a touchdown. I think that bodes well for a running offense, which gives them four plays to just run, run, run until they get the ball into the end zone. Exactly, coach. It's Arizona jobs to stop them, and they have unable. They don't never stop him on this drive. As we see number eight taking the toss sweep, but Arizona did a great job of recognizing that play. Taken down by number 11 on that. So after a great tackle by number 11, 
that brings up, a, after a, looks like a loss of one, uh, that brings up a second down and a, and a, and a, and a short 11 here. Um, now, I will say this about this team. I, I think that they're doing a little bit too much lateral running. And this is the difference. I mean, this is another Western United States team. So they got a lot of speed. I think what our guys should do is run right at these guys with those, with those uh, uh, great running backs that they have, that three-headed monster attack. Now we see number three with the handoff. Arizona is starting to tighten up on the run after San Diego finding some success earlier on this drive. Stop behind the line of scrimmage brings up a third and 11 from the 13 yard line. Got a San Diego State reference here. Um. <laughs> I don't know, the out of towner uh, doing the comments. San Diego's coming out with what a pass. That's the first throw of the game. That young man has to keep running. That's one thing about the youth game that we do notice in the passing game at the receiving uh, position. Guys don't finish routes. Uh, um, and I think that was a, that was the, the case there, and they fell prey to it. Um, in that situation, I'm, I'm, I'm not sure. They, they got inside uh, um, you know, the 10-yard line or just outside the 10-yard line. Go off it! Ran it to get down there. I wouldn't get cute at this point in the game. What do you think, John? Well, Coach, I think the San Diego coaches were trying to catch Arizona off guard. They've been running the ball all day long, maybe throwing the ball once or twice all game. Excellent opportunity for San Diego All-Stars to make a play right here. Arizona's backed up deep in their own end zone at the five-yard line. Let's see who can make a play. Number 17, Zach Evans, is, is very, very good. Let's go, defense! Huh? Oh, what happened? Oh. I don't hear some of those things. Yeah, that's why you got the turn. That's good. Let's go, defense! Second down play by Arizona was sniffed out very well Joe, by the you hear me? defense. Minimal gain <laughs> brings up third down. Ball is spotted at the 11 yard line. Can you hear me now? Arizona needs to reach the San Diego 16 to pick up a first down. Now you can hear me. As Coach mentioned earlier, both defenses seem to be a little bit ahead of the offenses. But they are loosening up as the game goes along. Oh, I don't know. That, that might be a bad, that's a bad call right there by the referees, but what can we do? Looks like he's going to call a, a pass interference on that ball, and it looked like it would have had to been Shaquille O'Neal to catch it. So we'll see. Uh, we'll see what the call is, and I think uh, it's going to be a pass interference, but it should be a flag that's picked up. Pass interference, San Diego. I agree, coach. That's a very questionable call. There was some miscommunication between the quarterback and the receiver on the play. The receiver had no idea what the ball was. There was a little bit of contact between him and the cornerback. But to call pass interference on that is a little, it's a stretch. 
I'm inclined to. So Arizona picks up the first down. Ball spotted at the 26 yard line. So they come out in their spread. Flash fake the fly sweep, but reverse. Coach, I agree. The preliminary call was holding, and now we see the ref confirming that call. It is a hold, which San Diego has declined. But the loss on the play makes sense to decline the penalty. Brings up third and about 13. Ball is spotted at the 22-yard line. Arizona needs to reach the San Diego 36-yard line to pick up the first down. So it's third down and a long 15. Uh, after the penalty, Coach McCall decided to decline and, and leave the, hand, uh, the ball in the hands of his defense. But after the, after the fake, number two gets in. He's a baller, and he has space to run. And they get the first down. You know they say hindsight is 20-20. Had he taken the penalty, it'd be fourth down right now. But he didn't. He trusted his defense, and it's a first down right now. Excellent play call, an excellent run by number two from Arizona. Absolutely, absolutely. Arizona comes out first and 10. Ball is spotted at the 39-yard line. As, as the cornerback runs off and almost knocks over the bleacher, and it's a great handoff. You know what I like about this Arizona team? I love the way this Arizona team I love the way this Arizona team with the ball motion and the ball fakes. They are very good at that. But it looks like it's going to be a personal foul on San Diego, number nine, after the play. Looked like he got a little too physical with him after the play, and I think that's going to be a personal foul. But let's wait and see what the penalty is. Unsportsmanlike conduct. Actually, it absolutely is on number nine. Coaches actually against both teams. Both players picked up a flag on that. Wow, both teams. And you know what? I think that was a good call. What we want to do here, we want to understand that this is an all-star game. So I think that the refs are doing a great job of preventing the chippiness right now. So that's going to be an offsetting penalty, and it's going to remain second down in a long five, uh, uh, second down and six. I agree, Coach. Great job by the referees keeping this game under control. So while we have a break in the action, we just want to let you know that this game is being brought to you by the uh, uh, by Pride Sports. Um, it's also being brought to you by Step. Um, just want to let you guys know that if uh, for your training needs, you can visit us at www.prideusports.org. As the Arizona All-Stars line up in a spread formation, and it's a straight run by number one after he puts on a great move. And he gets the edge and looks like he gets the first down. Great play by the Arizona All-Stars. And you know what it looks like what happened was I saw a guy coming, but it doesn't look like the, the, the San Diego defense is attacking. It looks like they're waiting. And when you do that, it allows for an extra two or three yards. That's why he gave up that line. I think that that, that play should have been a gain of three. But because they're waiting, right? Looks like he got a gain of five and a first down. Good effort by the young running back, or young quarterback, I'm sorry, of the Arizona All-Stars. Great point, Coach. San Diego's got to get a little bit more aggressive on defense. Instead of reacting to the play, force the action. Force the action. Number 17 takes the sweep. He's got some room on the outside. Gets to about the 37. I'm sorry, that would be the 43-yard line. Great call on first down. 
And I tell you what, too, uh, uh, James, the way that this, uh, um, the way that this offense is uh, um, is running the ball, it really starts with the offensive line. I mean, this guy's not getting touched. There is no, uh, uh, there's no one actually in the backfield. They're not getting any negative plays, and that starts by the meatloaf package up front. So here we go running a fly sweep motion and he stops it got a guy wide open across the middle but goes oh and it's picked off by olave who has if he runs he could have scored but did not what a great play and i'll tell you what after number two already made a great play number five olave with a great pick first down that's what i'm talking about doesn't look like he's going full speed out here but a great play nonetheless we've seen cornerbacks from both teams made excellent plays on the ball these kids out here playing hard coach First and ten, San Diego All Stars. Coach, after the turnover. San Diego lines up first and 10 from the 42 yard line. One of the offensive linemen, a little too jumpy on that. Picks up the penalty, false start, five yard penalty. Moves the ball back to the 37 yard line, first and 15. So on this sunny San Diego day, uh, beautiful day for football, I think that interception kind of keeps this San Diego team in the, in the game. I think a score there, and with this team having all of the momentum, it would have been tough. So a straight handoff to number five, and he's flipped by number 21. Way to attack the ball there by the San Diego, I mean by Arizona All-Star number 21. Excellent technique on that tackle. Squared up to the line of scrimmage and took the running back down. San Diego comes out second and about 13 from the 40 yard line. They need to reach the Arizona 47 to pick up a first down. So it looks like a two minute. So it's two minute warning here. And while we have that, while we take that time, two minute warning, we just want to let you know that this game is brought to you by Pride Youth Sports. Um, you can find all your training action, all of the game action, um, and a lot of things coming up as far as camps and clinics. Visit us at www.prideusports.com. Also, visit, uh, visit eysports.com for all your youth action from basketball to water polo to to hopscotch if it's youth sports they got it on eysports.com as long as i get a copy of as we come out of the two minute warning ball is spotted at the 40 yard line almost 41 second down and 13 Two minutes left to play in the first Again, San Diego needs to reach the Arizona 47 yard line to pick up the first down. So after the two minute warning, we're coming right back. Uh, Arizona All-Star has the ball. I mean, San Diego All-Stars, I'm sorry, have the ball with two minutes left to go. And a staggered backfield. And it's a toss to the right by number eight. If he runs, he got that corner. Looks like he had the corner. But James, I, I, I'm not sure. I'm not sure what I'm seeing. And these are all-star kids, but it doesn't look like they're playing at a hundred mile an hour rate that you have to play this ball game. And I think that's a that's been the problem for San Diego. Uh, I know one thing about Coach McCall. He'll get that fixed, and you're just working out the jitters. And that's what happens when you're playing the best of the best. You know, sometimes there's that jitters, and you might not be going full speed. But I think they'll get that taken care of. Great step back, cross the middle by number two. What a great pass! 
first down by the San Diego All-Stars. What a great play call and pass by this young quarterback. Excellent throw by that San Diego quarterback, Coach. And to go back to your point, I think San Diego is a little jittery. The nerves are still there. Uh, they're starting to shake it off a little bit, but it's still there. They're, they're, like you said, they're not playing 100% yet. San Diego calls the timeout. It's going to be first and 10. First and 10, we're under two minutes. So San Diego has crossed the Arizona to the Arizona side of the field. Ball is spotted at the 47-yard line with a break in the action. While well, we got a quick break, where all the Arizona fans at make some noise. Okay, Arizona, you can do better than that. Make some noise, Arizona. Okay, San Diego, show them how to do it. Make some noise, San Diego fans. As we come out of the timeout. One more time, Arizona. Arizona. Make some noise, San Diego Arizona lined up fans. in the I formation. I like that. That's what I want to see. The running back takes the handoff, number eight. With a pickup, I'll tell you what, coach, number 21 has been all over the field. That is the third tackle in a row. You know what, I'm going to tell you something. That guy's been all over the field, and he helped me set up the snack bar this morning. I mean, the kid's everywhere. The kid can do it all. Great play, number 21. So brings up a second down and long, and he steps back to throw, and he's got a guy open, but it's picked off by number two with his second interception of the game. And he stopped. What a great play. This is the second interception for number two. And he is making a very big run for our player at a game. Wow. Coach, it looked like number seven was hit just as he was releasing the ball. It caused it to be a little bit underthrown. Number two made a good, great play on the ball. And like you said, second interception of the game. So far, he's got my vote for player of the game. Absolutely. So now so it looks like a screenplay, number 17. Breaks a couple of tackles and stays in bounds to get the first down. And in you football, you know every time that, that clock stops, every time that, uh, that there's a first down, that clock stops. So far, Arizona has been the most, more efficient team, both on offense and defense. They have crossed the San Diego side of the field. There's a break in the action. Ball is spotted at the 42-yard line. Arizona's been doing an excellent job of moving the ball. As we mentioned earlier, the defenses have been doing a little bit better job than the offenses, and that's to be expected. But Arizona's starting to find its groove. Ball is spotted at the 42-yard line, first and 10. Ball spotted at the 42, like, like uh, James said, you know, first and 10. So number one drops back to pass. He's running, staying in there. Look like he's still, and he scrambles. Oh, what a great play and great effort by this Arizona All-Star team. These Arizona All-Stars came to play, and they are doing an excellent, excellent job. Great job by this Arizona All-Star team. Uh, we're still with a 6 nothing score, under two minutes to go in the first half. Arizona came ready to play. What an excellent play by the quarterback to avoid trouble and still get rid of the ball. Almost completed that pass to the receiver on the sideline. 
Second down, 10 yards to go. Line up in the spread, fake the handoff. Outside, uh, a quick pitch. And he gets out of bound. This is, a, this is a great play call by these guys, and, and they're making it happen. I tell you what, I'm really impressed with what Arizona is doing right now. That makes two of us, Coach. They have been the more aggressive team, been able to move the ball up and down the field, haven't had too much success getting in the end zone. But if they keep playing like this, that will, won't be too much of a problem. Arizona with the false start. It's going to back him up. Back to the original line of scrimmage. Makes it third and ten. Third it's third and ten, and ten from the 42-yard line. Arizona's looking to get to the San Diego 31 to pick up a first down. And with little time left on the clock, we'll see if they can punch it in the end zone, put, put up another score. Third down and 10, shotgun formation. They fake the pitch. Recovered by San Diego. What a play by the San Diego All-Stars. And I'll tell you what, for all the great coaching jobs, that was just a mishap by the Arizona guy. When it looked like it was, it was not a catchable ball, he stopped going after it. So for all the great job that they're doing with the coaching, I think that was a mental error that may cause them uh, late in the first half. No matter what, whether it's a fumble or not, you still have to go after the ball. I actually think that San Diego got a little bit lucky because it did seem to be a little bit of a Freeze gave San Diego the benefit of the doubt, called, ruled the ball a fumble. San Diego recovers, first and 10. The ball is spotted at the 46 yard line. First and 10, San Diego. We'll see if they can put up a score before the half. They need to find a little bit of momentum, something positive to take into halftime with. Absolutely. Also want to take the time to thank the great people at Snapple for being our, our major sponsor here. I want to, want to thank uh, One Coconut Water for being our official hydration partner here, coming out from L.A. We, we thank those guys for coming out and being a part of this game here today. Also want to thank the fine uh, folks at uh, uh, EYSports.com for doing a great coverage of, of youth uh, sports. Again, from football to badminton, you can get it at EYSports.com. So it looks like he's going to pass number eight. Throws to, to David Justice, who is tackled after a loss of about six yards. Looks like they're getting razzle-dazzle here. So we'll see what happens with this uh, this offense here, this close to the end of the half. Coach, that was an excellent play call. The execution was subpar. And that was the last play of the half as we go into halftime. The score is 6 nothing. Just want to make a, a few announcements. The, the snack bar is open. Please take advantage of that. Um, also, every uh, uh, person here will... Now you can arm yourself with the knowledge and training it takes to be great. Pride Sports and Step are proud to introduce the Pride Phenom Training Academy. This program features a nutrition plan, before and after evaluation, and a comprehensive instructional workbook. Former NFL quarterback Achilles Smith and Super Bowl winning wide receiver Oz Hakeem are our guest instructors. For more information on how you can sign up today, visit us at www.prideusports.org. Get combine ready. Get all-star ready. Get spring football ready today at the Pride Phenom Training Academy.